Gigabyte has made a design revision to its high-end GeForce RTX 4090 and RTX 4080 GPUs after incidents involving PCB cracking surfaced on the internet. For those unaware, several Gigabyte GeForce RTX 40 and RTX 30 GPU users were victims of a design malfunction in their PCB which led to cracks in a specific area. The cracks damaged the PCIe lanes inside the GPU, preventing data transfer and ultimately leading to a useless GPU. Several affected people tried to claim this issue with Gigabyte and ironically rejected their RMA request. While it led to a whole new debate amongst Redditors, it seems like Gigabyte has made some design changes with a new batch of GeForce RTX 4090 and RTX 4080 GPUs labeled as V1.1 with the original packaging. The news comes from the Redditor Misinformation Always, who managed to make a comparison between the older and newer versions of Gigabyte's GeForce RTX 4090 and RTX 4080 GPUs, and he noticed a significant change had been made, with the latest design coming with a beefier 70A VRM setup. This has made the overall design much more stable since the weight distribution has improved by a great margin. It is expected that this change might cater to the problem of PCB cracking in the upcoming units, but it is unfortunate for consumers already affected by it since it is reported that Gigabyte didn't entertain any of the RMA requests. Gigabyte hasn't officially mentioned the problem anywhere, and it isn't exactly confirmed what SKUs have received the new design changes. The design revision does entertain the fact that Gigabyte has acknowledged the flaw in their GPU units and it could be a possibility that the firm might amend its warranty service to facilitate the cracked PCB units. Despite that, consumers must take precautionary measures before mounting any of their Ada Lovelace or older GPUs with the inclusion of support brackets or an anti-sag mechanism. Just don't expect them to answer you other than that it's a user error, so be always watchful and also subscribe to the channel for new videos. See you in the next one. Bye everyone.